Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, we're gonna to attempt to make a progressive house drop in just 20 minutes. Before we get into it, I wanna give you guys some quick updates. So first and foremost, and most important, I just dropped a brand new song called That I Know with my boy Dastic. The reception so far has been absolutely amazing. It's doing really well on Spotify and stuff. And I'm really happy to see big DJs supporting it as well as all the fans enjoying it. So if you streamed it already and are enjoying it, thank you so much. It really, really does mean a lot to me. And on that actually, on That I Know, expect a walkthrough from both of us uh, talking about that I know and how we made it coming soon to the channel. All right, so now today's video, a lot of you guys really enjoyed the one hour song challenge, seeing me work uncut, you know, unfiltered, unedited, and uh, I also really enjoy the challenge. I thought today it'd be cool to try and mix it up and just do a drop only in 20 minutes. Today, I wanna make a progressive house drop, but if you guys enjoy this video and I don't absolutely butcher this, maybe going forward, uh, we could do this kind of like a serious 20 minute drop challenge and I'll do other genres and stuff just for fun. So with all that out of the way, let's get straight into it. So similar setup to my one hour song challenge project that I had. Um, this is basically my default template. I always work with a stereo imager and a limiter on the master. And then for today's project, I just opened up a bunch of plugins that I'm probably gonna use only because, uh, you know, with only 20 minutes on the clock, I don't wanna have to waste time opening plugins that will be a detriment to me. All right, so I have my timer set up now, 20 minutes. Um, before I click start, I wanna try to get a quick formula plan idea in my head. Um, it is beautiful weather here in New York. It's like 73 or 75 right now, where the real feel is at, whatever. It's gorgeous outside. And I'm thinking maybe we do something like happy summertime, progressive house, good vibes, something like that. Uh, kind of like my new song that I know, go check it out. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I guess maybe happier sunshine vibes. Sure. Here we go. Boom. Okay. So um, we'll start with the piano. We'll start chords. Happy. Summertime. I'm thinking F sharp for the key. A major, F sharp minor. Um, get very simple chords down. Something like this. Oops. Here we go. Okay, maybe what we'll do is we'll do F sharp here. Scoop this over here. I like the idea of starting on E actually, it sounds good. Oops, <laughs> here. Okay, there we go. And then just bum bum. So this will be D, this will be F sharp or A I mean. Yeah. All right, so that's that's good for now, nice and happy. Um instead of whoops, goodness. Instead of uh coming up with a melody on the piano, I want to get a synth going right away. Um let's see what we got here. This could be a good uh bass lead and then like we'll get a we'll get a super saw in here as well. We'll actually use sound for that. So let's get like a super saw-ish lead sound. Um, try Hardwell's pack. Okay, maybe this will work. We'll create a layer fast so we can control both of them at the same time. Boom, boom. Then we have to adjust the octave here because it's too low. This one's too high, adjust that quick. There we go. All right, that sounds pretty good. Let's put this back onto mixer five. Okay, I'm gonna add one more layer to this because it sounds um, like it needs some help. It needs some assistance. Um, and then here we're going to go for like a crazier, um, or not crazier, but just like more aggressive super saw. Either this one or the first preset. Let's see. Try this one quick. Okay, I like that one better. Cool. So this will be our 
weed group. My mixer is so tall. I'm not used to this one now. <laughs> okay, it's better. Okay, this will be lead group. Uh, we'll do very quick processing. We'll do Camel Crusher on British Clean. We'll do uh, a touch of OTT. Actually, no, we'll do Focus One. Okay, there we go. Um, I'm going to reduce the mix on the Camel Crusher. Give it some focus. Okay, that's fine. Um, we'll do maybe Valhalla. And then we'll do some delay. And this is just going to give it that space, make it progressive house esque. Uh, we'll just rock with simple ping pong if I can get to it. All right, melody, melody, melody. Let's see. Going to keep it really simple. You know what? Fast too. I'm going to add some compression. What am I at? 15 minutes already. Damn! All right, my goal is to get all the sounds done within like 10 minutes and then 10 minutes of like arranging and stuff. Hello? Okay, piano's compressed. Damn, okay. Uh... Wait, that sounds like a song already. Shit. Um, <laughs> uh, I'm fumbling. Okay, so I have uh, three minutes before I have to move on. What if I do... So I basically am just following the pattern of the chords like the top and then we'll just adjust some notes because I got to go.
this is gonna work for now i guess this is so not cool but listen i gotta go so this is gonna be our leads um i'm gonna quickly put the piano over her here piano i think we'll keep that in the drop it sounds pretty good let's get some other sounds going in now For the bass line, I'm going to also opt for Silent. Doesn't have to be too crazy. Maybe something in this pack here. This could work. Okay, I was waiting for that to stop. Uh, bass here. Actually, dang, this sucks too. Okay, uh, that bass will work for now as well. Let's get a sub going. This will be the sub here. I swear there was a sub priest. Yeah. Let's get some drums going in. We're at nine minutes already. Holy guacamole. Damn, this is kind of harder than I expected. Uh, let's get kick in. We're going to make a quick bass group so that I could just side chain and do all that easily. We'll do LFO tool. We'll go for Hey Child side chain. All right, sweet. Let's get some other uh, quick progressive house drums. Nah, those don't work here. Alright, so I want to get some better chords in as well. Um, I'm going to go back to Serum. Just clone this one. I think I can use some stuff that's already in my pack. Perhaps. Some like... Actually, don't I have chord things? Sorry. Yes, I do. No, come on. <laughs> Dude, what I love about this challenge is it just forces you to commit. Like, I'm not overthinking right now. I'm just grooving. Um, go back to my pack. Just because... <sighs> it's got what I want, okay? That's what I'm trying to say. Um, I need the slasher base. Yeah, 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 and then what I'm gonna do this uh, bleh, hello English <laughs> what I'm gonna do to this I'm gonna boost the mid-range a ton Take down this harshness Probably cut out the lows Get the capitator going and then here, Where's the base group here it is
maybe raising this an octave. What am I at? I'm only at six minutes. Damn. Yeah, it's better. What I would like to do is get the sounds a bit better. And then I could fix the melody. Sorry, I'm super sporadic right now. I'm trying to get this done. Here, boom. No, I don't like that one. Uh... piano um what i'm gonna do fast is chop this up better and then i'm gonna actually distort it a bunch i like doing this um with pianos in the drop for progressive house it makes it cooler We need another layer with the leads here. I just need like another monophonic-ish layer. I can do probably this one. And then maybe we could add a quick little fill or something for the uh, for the halfway. Perfect. What did I forget to add to the mixer? Why is it clipping? Whatever. Um, what am I at? Three minutes. All right, all right. I want to work on these leads more. Um, I'm going to... No, no, this is what I'm talking about. Okay, there we go. I want to boost the vids, take off some of this harshness. Try adding like a, a pad or something through analog lab. Three minutes left. Yo, not do too bad. I'm kind of impressed. Uh, sure. This is what it opened on. This one needs to go up an octave. Let's get some uh, let's get some cool fills in here. Two minutes and twenty seven seconds. Um, I want to actually put a crash here. Wait, where's my sub? This is it, right? Yeah, this stinks. Um, oh, you know what? We can do this. Here, here, here. Dub Vision has a great sub. That would sound good here. Yeah. I'm going to boost the heck out of this bass. I want more of that uh that low mids. 
This kind of drop would be sick if it had only a minute left. Damn, or left. It needs like shakers or something. Yeah, maybe this will work. Wait, what, what happened to my crash? Here, here. We'll put crashes on every four bars. Introduce some claps in the second half of the drop. Twenty seconds. Wait, can I get some hats in quick? Battlefield hats. Go. Is that it? Wait, can I get a drone synth? Let me get a drone synth, please. I forgot. No. Uh, uh, uh synth. No, 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 no. Air plug. Can I boost this? Three, four, seven thousand. Four, seven thousand. Oh, it finished. Wait. These are E, F, F sharp. Wait, that's only three. I'm moving it down three. Sorry. And I'm adding it to the mixer. And I'm going to lower it. This is cheating. Sorry, sorry, sorry. But nah, for real. Um, Wait, let me... I'm still working on it. What am I doing? I'm blatantly cheating right now. What am I doing? Okay. <laughs> sorry, I had to get the air plug in. Let's take a listen. Uh, from the top. So not my best work, but for 20 minutes, come on. That's got to be solid for 20 minutes. I actually love this challenge. Forcing myself to make something in 20 minutes, it just like that time pressure makes me uh, just commit. No procrastination, no uh, getting lost in the sauce, messing with sounds and stuff. It just commitment. And now there's an idea here, which is not my best work. But regardless, for a challenge, 20 minutes only, come on. This is pretty solid. This is actually a pretty good exercise for me. And uh, I hope this was entertaining for you guys as well. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so you guys know the drill. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell so you're notified the next time I upload. Go check out my new song with Dastig that I know and expect a walkthrough of us talking about how we made it coming to the channel maybe next week. So yeah, get hyped for that. That should definitely be a good one. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in the next video. Oh,